Welcome back. All day, WCNC, NBC Charlotte has been taking care of teachers. It is our day of giving as our entire station teams up with Classroom Central. Well, if you've never heard of Classroom Central, they're an organization that really equips students in need by collecting free school supplies for all of their teachers. They do it through a variety of ways. And right now, our team is at Lawrence Orr Elementary, where teachers are on a shopping spree. Yeah, listen to this. Teachers spend hundreds of dollars a year of their own money, but a majority of teachers spend upwards of $500. Michelle Bowden live across town at Classroom Central store and Michelle, this is an organization that does so much for our community. Yeah, this place really is amazing. I had a chance to talk to some of the teachers. They literally come in here. They say it is like Christmas morning because they take a look at these shelves and they're allowed to take what they need for their students in need. For teachers, it's like winning the lottery. This is amazing. I love Classroom Central. It's awesome. Copy paper. It's definitely an incredible resource for teachers. Journal. What does it feel like when you're walking through this? <laughs> Office supply. Elation. Elation. Classroom Central is really a gift to our, our community teachers. So essentially we serve as a free resource for them to come and to pick up all the materials that they and their students need to be successful in the classroom. Thank you so much. Because so many students come to school without even pencils or crayons. It hurts my heart. It really does. It, you know, that they can't have basic school supplies. Teachers at schools where more than half the students are on free and reduced lunch are allowed to come shop here at Classroom Central. And it's all free, which is awesome. <laughs> you're literally shopping for your kids. Yes, shopping for my kids for free. <laughs> and I see you're just getting excited talking about yes, it. Yes, I'm so excited. This is, you come once a month, and this is like what I look forward to once a month. So I'm guessing you're like my mom, who every year we went to buy school supplies for her kids because she was a teacher. <laughs> do you probably, you spend a lot of your own money? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. And it's, I mean, it's a hard thing, but it's worth it. They're worth every bit of it. Um, and then plus with what we get from here, it kind of supplements what I buy, so I don't have to buy as much. So this, this helps all the whole. <laughs> Everything here is donated, and volunteers work with staffers to make it all happen. The minivan. The minivan. Yep. Every single Monday, every single Tuesday, we let teachers come in. They are shopping for free, so they are excited. They feel cared for. They feel loved by this community. Just how much love? Take a look at some amazing numbers. During the last school year, 4.8 million in supplies were distributed to 199 schools in six area districts. That's more than 4,400 teachers and 88,000 students all helped because of Classroom Central. So if you want to help get involved in Classroom Central, there are tons of ways to help. Take a look. As you've heard, WCNC, our staffers have been out here all day. We've got Rachel and Eugene, you probably recognize from on air. They're helping with glue sticks right now. There are other ways you can help as well by making donations. And now is the perfect time to make that donation because the Leon Levine Foundation is matching donations. So easy way to give money that's going to double. And I also just heard from my producer that Bill actually <laughs> stacked the shelves behind me. So all of us have been out here all day because Classroom Central is such a great cause. Yeah, we put Bill to work. Wait, somebody's has, somebody had to do something. Hey, right? I was over there cutting those side cards. <laughs> yeah, we were busy. And oh, we they enjoyed didn't tell me that. And we <laughs> enjoyed, yeah, we enjoyed doing it. Anything really we can do to help our teachers.